Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Vincent Hayes. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm sure you're probably wondering why we, we need yet another YouTube channel. Uh, but I wanted to uh, use this as a way to, for me to be able to share one of my passions, which is real estate. I'm a real estate professional in the Bay Area, specifically in Oakland. Uh, this won't be one of those shows where I'm standing up and I'm being animated and all that. Uh, it's really just going to be, you know, me being my authentic self and sharing things that I've learned as a real estate investor, as a real estate agent, and also through doing the build out work as a general contractor. So um, for me, uh, I, my main goal here is to help try to uh, make the novice investors uh, entry into real estate investment a little bit smoother, a little bit easier, try to minim help minimize some of the mistakes. Also to be able to share um, uh, information with other investors that are already out there doing it, already doing great work. Uh, so please feel free uh, in the comments to uh, ask questions, push back on anything that you see or, or, or that I say in, in any of this content uh, because it's only gonna make the community better. So a little bit about me. Back in 2011, my wife and I moved out to the Bay Area here in Oakland, and uh, I immediately jumped into business school. I was at the time a web developer and, and wanted to uh, start my own business doing something. And so after business school, I jumped into small business consulting. But that was something that went horribly wrong, and so I had to pivot. At the same time, I was watching uh, some friends that were in Boston doing some great work around real estate. They were doing flips, they were doing rentals, and I was like, hey, this looks cool. And so I raised some capital, jumped into my first flip. Uh, I made some money, had some interesting experiences, uh, but it whet my appetite, and so I was hooked from that point on. I did three more flips. Uh, out of those four, I probably had an average return of 22% in terms of cash on cash return. Uh, but then decided, hey, I feel like there's some changes going on in the market. Let me try to do some bigger development projects and see if I can hit some home runs that way. So I took an old commercial building and decided to convert it into five live work loss. That was a painful experience, but it was a great experience. And during that time, uh, going through challenges with general contractors, uh, trying to meet ex investor expectations, uh, I decided like, how can I minimize some of the downside risk of doing some of these deals? And so that's when I decided, hey, I'm gonna jump in and get my real estate license. Also, I'm gonna do uh, the general contracting thing. And so now at a point where I'm actually looking to kind of pivot, uh, and readjust my strategy because initially I was just solely about flips and, and, and never even looked at doing rentals just because I was afraid of what I would have to deal with with a tenant and be a landlord and all that. Uh, but now uh, the understanding that I have based on my last big project that was a huge headache is that you still got to be able to put food on the table. And so for me, when I think about what my big why is when I do these projects, it's going to be my family. And so when I'm jumping into something that's long term and it's a big deal and has potential for uh, risk that, uh, you know, maybe I didn't see when I did my due diligence, uh, you know, I have to start thinking about what are the things that I can do to still be able to take care of the family, but still advance and, and, and accomplish goals in real estate. So where am I going with all this? Uh, after, you know, the tough experience with the condo project, I thought this would be a great way to be able to help uh, a new entrepreneur think about how to uh, structure their entry into real estate. Or if you're an entrepreneur or and you're looking to kind of pivot from what you've been doing and maybe get into flips or maybe get into uh, real estate rentals, then my goal is to try to help you. So. Um, one of the things that I wanted to make sure that you understood, I said it earlier, but I want to reiterate it again, this is more of a community type of effort. So even though my face is going to be on the video and, and generating all the content, uh, I really want you to participate by sending, sending your questions, sending in comments, uh, and pushing back on anything that you hear that I say that maybe doesn't sound right or maybe you don't understand. I really want to make sure that we're getting the most out of this time that we spend together. I think there's, this is a great time and a great opportunity for anybody that wants to get into real estate and, and real estate investing. And this doesn't have to be an investment for you as a entrepreneur. This could be your first investment into a home of your own for your family. I mean, some of the same fundamentals still apply. You still have to be able to finance a transaction 
transaction, you still have to make sure that the transaction is going to work for you. Generate the right amount of equity if you ever want to sell. So, I mean, there are many things that no matter what, if you're an investor or if you're just a home buyer, some of these same things, some of these same principles apply. So I just want to make sure that even, even in all of this, if, if you're not looking to get into investing, there's still some nuggets that you can gain as you look to try and buy your first house or buy your move up house or, you know, whatever you're going to do in real estate. So I'm very excited about the direction of this YouTube channel. I hope that you subscribe to the channel and I hope you're going to be watching each week. And I hope that you're going to be asking questions and leaving comments so that we can uh, become better real estate investors. And I look forward to talking to you soon.